You might be in a situation where you are getting this little pop-up on your iPhone where it basically says unable to load video. So it says something like unable to load video, an error occurred while loading a higher quality version of this video. Now the main way to go and fix this, because it is a pretty easy process, is to go ahead and just make sure you have enough storage on your iPhone saved up, that way you can actually play this video. So what I would recommend doing here is going through, opening up your specific settings application, in this case I'll just go and exit out once more, opening up your settings application, you want to go inside of general, so click general right here, and then you want to go and click on iPhone storage. So iPhone storage is right here, you want to click there, and you'll come into this panel. Now what you want to do here is you want to basically go through and clear out as much storage as possible. If your video, like if your iPhone is almost completely out of storage, well that is basically going to be the reason why this is happening. So go ahead and clear out as much storage as you can, delete any things you're not using anymore, and then what you can do there is go back, try replaying that video, and that video may end up being fixed. Now if for some reason that's still not working, the video that you've downloaded, it could very well mean that that video is not really suited for iPhones. So sometimes I know if it's some weird file extension, or if it's like a random video, like that's not even a video, but it somehow got here, that can also be a problem. Also, if it says something like unable to load video in an application, that may mean either you don't have any, like a good internet connection, it could also mean that possibly that video is taken down from that user. So potentially maybe somebody shared a video with you, but they've deleted that video or unsent that video, either it's on Twitter or maybe they did it through iMessage or whatever, and now it's unable to load. So that's probably another thing to keep in mind. You can also try restarting your phone. So you can just you know, hold down the buttons to restart your phone, slide to power off. That might end up fixing it too. Ultimately, if that's still not working, you can just click on settings, or you can try updating your phone. So go back into your iPhone settings here, click on general, click on software update, and just go ahead and update your iPhone. And that is another thing you can do as well. So those are pretty much the main ways to do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.